Shrek came here from far, far away to be on your podcast. And have you ever kicked a baby? The way ogre babies are made. Mama ogre and daddy ogre love each other very, very much. Don't miss your part a little bit. No, keep going with this. Guys, we get to start the podcast. It's cold in here. And usually he starts it, so... I'll take the initiative, but we'll all go back to sibling therapy and the number one sibling podcast here on YouTube. All right, cool. And then back in trainer, her brother was like, oh, what the heck? We made fear. Just okay, well, Cole has a bit. We can yeah. back on that. Okay. He said, Gabriella, I'm unable to make it to therapy. However, oh. I invited a friend who's just like Eden, oh. has plenty of problems to talk about at therapy, and also hates men. Wait, did he dress up as or did he actually get someone? I'm. So you want? There's someone at the door. Who oh, is it? In this wall. Okay, literally, why? Why? <laughs> what? Bro, My name's Paul. Great to meet you. For what reason? I'm Hi. so confused. Thanks for having me on the podcast. Your green, so... your green is getting on the mic. Oh, oh, I like when my green gets on the mic. Oh, wait. Are we interviewing Shrek today? Oh, uh, it's a pleasure to be here. You know, I'm not, I'm, I'm used to sitting next to an ass, but I guess I still am. <laughs> well, also, Shrek, your pants are way too small for you. Well, you don't have a lot of resources when you live on this wall. Also, I feel like your shoulders are open. <laughs> what is happening here? I've been working out. <laughs> You're just like all that. The way all your babies uh, are made. You know, Mom, the oh, get it, and build that thing. Oh, wait, we didn't think like, to play. Sorry, very, very much. Yeah, it's very. Yeah. Oh, get it, and build that thing. Wait, we didn't think to play. Sorry, for the audio listener. Great to be here. What are you talking about? That Shrike does. What was this? Shrike also has a fear of men. Is that yeah, yeah, wait, wait, wait. Maybe it's Shrike. The other mics weren't recording. Whose? Whose? Only Gabriella's. What? Just Hold! Dude, Shrek, you literally have one job. Welcome back. <laughs> Wait, are they able to hear? Yeah, we have the camera mics. I just want to be as nice. Okay. Well, Why did you, like, jump to the <laughs> the Elsa, the big summer blowout accent? You're like, <laughs> nice. <laughs> they won't be as nice. Big summer blowout. <laughs> what, what questions do you want to ask me? <laughs> I don't know if we have that many questions. Okay, Cole does this thing where, like, he has bits, but doesn't tell us <laughs> he, the bits. That expects them. us to, like, pick up the bits. Oh, well, I mean, whose podcast is it? Right? It's not an Onion podcast that's out on Spotify, though. What? <laughs> I feel like I'm, like, disassociating. I'm, like, I don't understand what's happening. I, I don't even know how you don't understand. Shrek came here from far, far away to be on your podcast with your siblings. But the podcast. Shrek doesn't have siblings. I thought we had a rule where you had no, to be. No, you have siblings. <laughs> Okay, so... What's on your September bucket list, Shrek? Yeah. Well, I'd have to think about that. Probably picking some onions from my onion field. Maybe eating some earwax. Terrorizing children. The usual. What about you? I literally think there's a booger in your nose. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, yum. Yum, yum, yum. I can, like, see it waving. Waving? It's just like... Like, hello to you? Do you feel it? Uh, do I feel it? I feel a lot on my face right now. Um, okay, Shrek, what's your favorite movie? Mm, that's a tough one. Shrek 1, 2, and 3. Aren't they coming out with the new Shrek? Yes. Wait, okay, not, give us a sneak peek. I can't say a lot about it, but all I can say, Tom Cruise is in it. Is it <laughs> Shrek 5? Yeah. Wait, Gabriel, is that why you were green to I apparently... Oh. Wait, are you Fiona? Uh, that would be weird. <laughs> I was just uh, on the same wavelength, apparently. But looping back to the movies, so are they documentaries? Of my life? Yes. Yes, please ask any questions. I'll, I can provide behind the scenes, a little additional discourse. What? Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't really have that many questions. I don't just sit around thinking well, of what also, to ask. We don't need to typically interview. In <laughs> this is an interview podcast. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay, we'll start from the beginning. Okay. Shrek, 
The way Olga babies are made. Mama Olga and Daddy Olga love each other very, very much. Do we skip forward a little bit? No, keep going with us. Well, and then let's just say they make deep green. And then... <laughs> you, you said you wanted me to keep going and I kept the MPG. Oh, my land. Oh, oh, my God. So then baby Shrek was there. And have you ever kicked a baby? <laughs> oh, what is happening? I'm just asking which side of the fence you're on, the good side or the bad side, because I... I don't think you want yourself clip sick. <laughs> <laughs> I meant an older baby. An older baby. I have uh, never no. kicked an older baby. Okay, good. So don't. They hated me because I was different. Just because of the color of my skin. Do you guys have that problem here? So wait, you were kicked as a baby? Because I'm d- all I'm trying to say is... There are, okay. there are racist ogres who kicked you as a baby. No, the people! We try so hard to keep you from getting canceled. And all I'm saying you just walk is you right must into love him. each other okay. no matter the, dif- the difference. Of the, of the skin color. Did you watch my movies? I don't think it had anything to do with you being green more with the fact that you were what, an ogre. Okay. Wait, I'm so confused. Is this whole podcast <laughs> so literally just going to revolve around Shrek? Maybe. Why? <laughs> okay. So, we'll play a little game. If you guys win, I'll drop the accent. If I win, we keep the accent. Okay. It's not even the accent, it's the persona. <laughs> persona of what? <laughs> Shrek. Okay, so you hate Shrek? Yes. Ah! <laughs> Shrek attacked her. See, this is why people don't like you. <laughs> Just, get this? the pitchfork. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, the 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 I feel not safe. <laughs> you sh- I don't feel safe. I don't feel safe. You just grab me by the neck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm thinking of a color. Green. Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> Yay! Drop the accent! Fine! <laughs> Calls back. Yay. This isn't as fun anymore. Okay, it also sounds like you're like choking on the prostate. <laughs> Do you want to take it off? No, I, I have to stay like this whole episode. <laughs> this is literally glued to my face like cement. I just want to know why you're like you just decided to be in costume. Like we could have had like a costume themed episode. What? No, because I said it was gonna be a big episode this week. Oh, oh. this is the big. How could I come? What didn't come in? We had all this stuff. Oddly enough. Yeah. So I. You said something didn't come in in time. I said that because I didn't order anything. I was <laughs> making an excuse. Then yes, it would not have. Come but in we had time. all of this. And now and then I had the idea last week. I was like, I could just be Shrek. Well, why oh, we so you just, just lied characters? last time. You didn't have any idea. On the nose. You got it correct. Wait, we could have all been a character. That would have been funny. Well, and it, and good. Oops, sorry. Good. <laughs> what? Okay. If I had a witch's brew for every time that hole <laughs> has touched me this episode, I'd have two witch's brews. Okay. If I had a witch's brew for every time I had to go save a princess from a freaking castle. You'd have won. I guess one less than you. Big woo. <laughs> Anyways. The um, good thing about the costume, you have a second chance. Because I'm excited to announce now that we're in spooky season. Um, According to Gabriella, we're actually not in spooky season yet. Um, Well, get ready, girl. Because <laughs> every week until Halloween... I'm going to be coming as a character. Okay, that seems a little uh, long to start in September. <laughs> so for two full <laughs> two months. For two two months, months. You're going to dress up as a <laughs> Yep. That may be more than I can chew. I feel like October we yeah. can commit to this thing. <laughs> well, I started now. You should have told me that later. That's Oh, I'm just going to veto that idea right now. We're not doing four episodes in September. Okay, no, you I are mean, not you... doing four episodes. Shrek can do whatever he pleases. No, we collectively have to go through this. Well, so I feel like October is a good time for this to restart. Luck. We should do a Beatles. This was a sneak peek. This is going to come out to like middle of September anyways. Everyone's going to be in the Halloween spirit. True. Oh, true. We're like okay, well, what about episodes. the next four? Because then that'll line up with 
October. I, I don't understand why you guys are complaining <laughs> about me literally providing great content for the podcast. Okay, guys, comment down below what costumes we should dress up for for the Scorytober podcast and, season. Oh my gosh, Ooh. that's great. Every episode will also have a costume contest and Sylvia can judge who's the best. <laughs> Wait, now we're all dressing up every single episode <laughs> in October? You could, or I just win every single time. <laughs> At the end, we're going to tally up who wins. And, and what did they, they win? Prize. What did they win? Unlimited witches brew? Yeah. Okay, but what about the people who listen to this every single week? They just have to oh. listen to subscribe the costumes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can we do where we dress up as each other for one episode? Oh, that'd be funny. Oh, that would be so, funny. Like, I'll be every no, I'll be Cole because the guys have to be the girls and the girls have to be the guys. So I'll be Cole, you be Tyler. I have to be Gabriella. And then you have to be Gabriella. <laughs> what say like that? I mean, how am I supposed to dress she up? Should be honest. Okay. You have to, to be do me. like wigs. Like you're yeah. supposed to do fake facial hair. She like, just has to dress up like JoJo Siwa. What? what? Who's Jojo Siwa? Tyler doesn't look like Jojo Siwa. No, we remember you said that Gabrielle has the same taste as Jojo Siwa. Okay, when, first of all, when, when did she say that? that? First of all, literally, you said that. I know. Second of all, bus. this is in a random group chat that has nothing to do with what we're talking about. Is the iPhone recording? Random question. Let's go. Okay, well, I think the vote will be unanimous for me winning this episode. All right, you can take win. Well, I don't know. Gabrielle could be Fiona. Because she's in a green dress. True. Where's her red hair? Where's her be, red hair? I could be Fiona when she's just the regular princess. <laughs> Next week. Let's put it to a vote. <laughs> Guys, comment down below who has the better costume. Gabrielle as Fiona or Cole as Shrek. Daddy, do the roar. Roar. Dude, I used to be obsessed. We used to say that all the time. All the time. We would just walk. Like, people probably were so confused because, like, anywhere, everywhere, we'd just be like, Daddy, do the roar. Daddy, do the roar. No, he doesn't say daddy. He just says, do the roar. She goes up to people. You added the daddy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. What? You There's no daddy. You added the daddy. He just says, do the roar. No. Oh, you're right. He says, daddy, make him do the yeah, roar. Yeah, he says, daddy, yeah. make him do the roar. <laughs> <laughs> daddy, do the roar. The, yeah, that's kind of crazy. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Do the roar. Next week. Do the roar. <laughs> next week, my costume is amazing. Do the roar. <laughs> And if you do the roar. Well, I don't know where to how to take this. Do the roar. There's no segue for this. You have to do the roar. Okay, here we go. Ready? Do the roar. Roar. Oh. 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 Hey, you lost at the end. You lost at the end. He's like, he's like mm. Daddy, I love you. <laughs> what? That's also what Eden says. No. Why are what? you doing your finger? <laughs> like, Daddy, I love you. It's a clip. He pulls him down, but he's like, Daddy, I love you. Oh my god! He literally goes, Daddy, I love you. I also. <laughs> We're gonna look up this clip. This. We are because we'll do it right yeah. now. Look okay. it up. We will. Get in fact. Because he he literally is like, Daddy, do the, make him do the roar, do the roar, and he's like, then he's like, my son wants to hear you do the roar, and then he does the roar, and he's like, Daddy, Daddy I, love I love you. you. Yes. I was there. This, I would remember. <laughs> this just reminds me. I was listening to a podcast or the uh, Josh's. Oh, you already have it up. What's Sanders? Don't Jonathan. even say the brand name. Yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's me! I'm looking for daddy. I'm looking for the little finger motion. <laughs> what is this? This sounds like an edit. Daddy, I love you. Oh, they she did! Oh. No, they did! <laughs> yes, they did. Okay, ready? Yeah, we can't keep listening yeah, to Shrek. No, this is it. Just jump to the very end. Okay. Ready? Shh. Ready? I'm just Ready? saying he never said daddy. Yeah, he did. And. Ready? Oh! She did! He said I love you, daddy! He said I love you, daddy! Anyways, I just had to be weird. I'm glad you did. Well, I had a question for everyone because I went to bed the other night. I don't know why I thought this. It's very random. Okay. I don't do a lot of random more things. Ra more random than you dressing up as Shrek without telling us? Yeah. I was terrified as a child. I was sleeping in my necklace. 
Because mom and dad told me it would choke me in my sleep. Did they ever tell you that? I didn't have that, but I was told the hoodie strings would. Yeah, they would say that for the necklaces and then I for, was, like, the hoodie strings. I was terrified, though. I don't think they understood how scared I was. I would wake up and, like, take my necklaces off if I fell asleep with them. <laughs> mm, I didn't have that, but I had a lot from Grandpa, and he told me that we were driving not to grab the leaves on the tree because if I held on to them, they'd yes. pull me out of the car. That, I believe. Well, he told me it would rip my arm off. I oh, didn't get pulled yeah. out of the car. He told me it would rip my arm off. Why do <laughs> grandparents always say the craziest thing? I was playing poker with my grandfather once, and he told me if I cheated, he was going to shoot me in the kneecap. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> yes, he did. <laughs> he said you would get shot Justice in the Justice for kneecap. Papa. He, he said, said you if you Vegas, played in Vegas, they would get. shoot you in the kneecap then for cheating. What? And then because, he made me cry. I was like you, also seven. Also because you were cheating. You were cheating. You were cheating. And you yes, kept- yeah. No, cheating implies... That you don't know that they're doing it. I literally was like, the table's glass. I can look under the table and look at the glass. <laughs> that's the definition of cheating. I was seven. And he taught you not to cheat. Because he threatened to shoot me in the knee. He yeah. did he not. Didn't. He, he told said, you what if you went to Vegas and you did that, they would shoot you in the kneecap. Now, imagine if you didn't hear that. You kept your cheating ways ever since you were a child. You go to Vegas and then you cheat at a table and you know what happens there? They don't shoot. No. They probably did back then. 100%. Oh, sure they don't do that now. 100%. Well, they throw you out and you go to jail. Okay. Cheating is a very serious offense. At least offense. you can have your walking abilities. Okay. I also remember that grandpa told me if I ate the watermelon seeds, that a watermelon would grow in my stomach. And that one scared me. That one messy. And then there was the Rugrats episode where it did grow in his stomach. My, gram- like this scene from my grandpa told me that if I crossed my eyes, they would stay that way. But I think that's kind of true if you do it too many I- times. I'm going to say something, and it may be way too much information. Oh, gosh. As a child, I could pull my belly button out. Oh, I used to do that, too. Because it was an any outie, which means where it sits halfway between in I and could, out. I could and we could. my inner belly button and pull it out, and it would protrude. And my next-door neighbor told a five-year-old me that he used to have a son who did that. And he blew up like a balloon and flew away. I never <laughs> did that again because no. I was so scared. Because why did we That's do hilarious. that though? Like, why did we just like randomly discover that we could like pop our I don't innies remember, out? I don't remember this is a uh, wee thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did it all the time. Uh, I have an innie, and so. And then it would like slowly go back in. Ew, what? Okay, That's literally, yeah. we're moving topics <laughs> and you're very close to listening to your mic privileges, <laughs> both of you. This is disgusting. <laughs> What? What are you going to say, Eden? Nothing. I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> okay. Well, the other one I'm just curious about, and then we'll move on. Gum. Eating gum stays in your stomach for seven years. True or false? False. They determined that. Yeah. I think that's false. I think it's false. But it I, scared me. And then it was well, so nice to swallow I also could gum. never figure out how to swallow <laughs> gum. It was so nice. I was going to say, I'm pretty sure it's a good, like, Lesson for kids to believe in, though, because you should not be just swallowing your gum. Cause, like, but it was so fun as well, a kid. I had a problem, like, swallowing pills and stuff, so I never was able to swallow gum. But, like, I think that was the reason. And then one time, I think I had accidentally went, like, <gasps> like as a gasp, and it shot to the back of my I, I swallowed a many Ugh. gums as a kid. But a I many- also ate dirt. <laughs> Why were you so weird? You tell me you didn't look me in the eyes. And solemnly swear you never ate dirt. I solemnly <laughs> swear I have never, ever eaten yeah, dirt. Yeah, I've never eaten dirt. What was the context? Have you, of eating dirt? Yeah, like you just went outside with a spoon. Noah and I and would sit eating. underneath the park and then we would eat the sand. What? <laughs> so that's like a deficiency. I think there's actually a word for that. It is. It's like a condition. What about, like when what dogs eat grass. Pika? Here. Yeah, that's literally <laughs> pika. Pika. I had pika? I, I probably... You oh, and Noah, okay. gotta okay, check him I on think him. Pika's actually like serious, so don't throw it around. But yeah. <laughs> okay, well, I didn't know what it was. I wasn't just throwing it around. <laughs> what did it taste like? <laughs> it was kind of oh, gritty. I wonder if like, that's the same thing. I knew a kid who would eat tape, like the glue <gasps> off a of tape. Ew! Ew! The glue yeah, off like he would a take tape? Strips of tape. 
and then put it in his mouth <gasps> and then like, oh! lick it in here, and then pull it out Ew! once it was clean. That Ew! literally made me Ew! <laughs> Ew! It was Ew! someone in our like church group. Okay, do you want to know something though? As a kid, that's messed up. This was crazy. I was a very like secretive kid, and I had this little little closet hideaway, and I'd go in it. And one time I was in there, and I had a pen. And I had the Did thought. Did you suck the ink out of the pen? <gasps> oh! yes. Well, it exploded in her mouth and she goes, <laughs> And Wait. then we're like, Eden, what were you doing in there? And she was like, nothing. Her mouth okay. is like literally blue. It and was the, the guy in the green costume is the weird one. I literally have never tasted. Like, do not, do not eat ink. It was the like scariest feeling because I actually felt like I like tasted what I imagined poison to taste like. Yes. And then I remember my dad had to like the, call poison control. I don't think you intentionally were sucking it. I think you were biting on the pen and it broke in your mouth. So. I think that's what happened is that you were chewing I on it. I took it out. Right. Then there was that clear tube. And then I think what it really was was I had the thought where I was like, well, the ink's not spilling. So I wonder right. if I like... Put it like in you my weren't mouth just like let me go suck out the ink from the but pen. But it scared me so bad because it shot in my mouth, and then I like dropped the pen, and I was like, <gasps> and it scared me so bad, and I went running out of the closet, and like literally my mouth looked like a black so hole. Scary. Like it literally looked like a black hole, and then my dad was like, "What happened?" And then they had to call poison control on his whole thing. <laughs> that is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Suddenly, very cool. Just needs sand. a shirt that says that. that was crazy. <laughs> Who, me? Yeah. yeah. That da, 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 was crazy. crazy. That's like sometimes when I like talk to people, I can't tell if he's actually entertained <laughs> by me or if it's like pity. Like, e- that's crazy. <laughs> anyways. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> like, well. But anyways. <laughs> actually is. I'm like, do you <laughs> care about what I'm saying? I Sorry, I'm idea. so boring. Well, maybe be funnier. See, like, <laughs> that's what I mean. <laughs> you set that one up for me to dump. Okay, you're, when first you gotta keep it going. What the heck? You guys just stop talking. That's I was gonna say something and then I changed my mind against it. Say it. No. Say it. No. I she said I day. don't want to start war. Okay, I'm gonna point out the next time you trip on your word then. What? <laughs> he's, he's gonna hold that against you. Was that English, guys? This keeps happening where I hear people say stuff and it does not sound like English. So that's I called heard- the stroke. It's-, <laughs> <laughs> it's defects from eating ink as a child. <laughs> <laughs> That's called lead poisoning as a child. <laughs> Long term also, effects of swallowing a pen. I feel like it needs to be clarified that it's probably just you hear us say things or are you hearing it from other people? Because we talk so fast. We do. Sometimes I'm like, slow down. And sometimes grab the wall. <laughs> we gonna get you out of here. Fall off. Gas pedal. Gas pedal. Did you guys hear the gas pedal John Summit remix? We heard it first at his concert. Wow, we went through a lot of things in that five seconds. John Summit This is what it's like to be inside your brain, isn't it? Yes. So you're saying this is what 88... That is what I'm saying. I think I am literally the persona of ADHD. I'm like, I'm ADHD's sidekick. Where I'm like, I'm not like quite there, but I'm like right next to you. (laughs) You know what I mean? Oh, kind of like Donkey? Yes! Oh, my God. Or Dulox. You guys are the same height. Oh, I don't want to be Dulox. <laughs> okay, how is John His name Summit? was Lord Farquaad. Dulox was the place. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> you right. Learn you your right. Shrek lore. This song is like, things are looking up here in Dulox. They're looking up. Shine your shoes, wipe your face. <laughs> oh, Okay, different back to John Summit. Keep your hands off the grass, tie your shoes, wipe your face. <laughs> Do lock here. Do lock here. Anyways, um, John Summit was so fun. I was it, very upset. It was a rave, right? Yes. It was. Boom, 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 boom. Technically, it was a house show. A rave is more like the. like. Rah, 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 rah. This was more like. Bum, bum, bum. Anyways, I was very upset. Is that the official I, differentiation? I did not see Ashton or Alex Earl. I'm just going to say it. Are they dating? Who? Well, Ash. Dude, go on TikTok. Oh my god! I can't. I'm like ninety percent deaf. I scared the this. accent back in there. <laughs> <laughs> I scared him so bad. He had the accent come back. Oh my gosh! Ash and Earl is Alex Earl's sister, and she's dating or whatever situation shipping john, john summit. summit so she's been at a bunch of his wait, shows wait 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 wait. who's his name is john summit yeah oh i thought it was john summit 
like a mountain you thought no like, like a like, summit like, like a, a place conference. like you got a conference oh <laughs> john summit like right. bid summit no john summit no he's the one that sings the song that's like i get well he dj's the song it's like i get this feeling i want to be where you are so this situation i don't think i've heard that is she trying to summit or is she stuck at base camp <laughs> Wait, I don't know. Let's have Ashton Earl on the podcast with Alex Earl because they're siblings. I don't know who either of these people are. <laughs> yeah, you don't know. Who you I- better stop. <laughs> you don't know who Alex Earl is. Listen, I'm not like a mega fan, but I definitely keep my tabs on her. Isn't like, she you don't know about her. She just got Earl canceled. Family? Well. Like they, what do you everyone mean? loves to throw the word cancel around now. No, she has some dirty tweets. Did you Baba. see that? Like no? Brooks already bad on canceled. Like again, like no one really gets canceled anymore. That's true. They said being canceled is actually net positive for people. I'm sure it Probably. is. Like Brooks back on the canceled podcast. Is Brooks one of their siblings? Wait, so she was canceled. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong family. <laughs> Wait, it, what? What? <laughs> I honestly Alex can't Earl, so Alex Earl's covered. podcast is hot mess. Her sister is Ashton. Tana Mojo has canceled, and her co host is Brooke, who got canceled. But then Tana also got canceled. Who's call me daddy? Oh, that's a different vibe. I, I know who she is. Alex Cooper. Um, Cooper. She should have the I love you, daddy. I'm call me daddy. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? You you DM her that. You wait, DM her that plan. Wait, go so go back to the Earls. Who are they? Who are the Earls? Gabriella, we literally work in oh, social media. She's the girl. I don't mean to I might recognize their face. She has she looks 30, but she's like 25. She's 22. Right? She's old, she's, she's 20, younger than me. Alex Earl is Alex Earl's younger than me. She, has she had fun? Can I see a picture of her? Yes, and she's open about that. Okay. Can I see so a picture of her? Yeah, she looks like 30. Not like, like in a bad 30. And she's dating the football player. But she just looks matuated. What like, does that what? mean? <laughs> like matured? Like when something fully I don't think matuates? That's the word. Matuated? Yeah, like she looks like I've she. I've never heard that word before. Assumed her adult form. Like when she's like, <laughs> I'm 30 now. Okay. No, no, don't write that one down. Don't write that one down. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. I mean, like, you like her. She looks like a Kardashian. She's 22. I don't think I've ever seen this person. Let me see. What? What kind of TikToks does she do? Am I thinking of the wrong person? No, this is her. She looks older in her video. What kind of TikToks does she do? Like, she just, yes, like, that doesn't look like she just, says, like, that's you cannot, younger than Like, she me. looks like she owns a business and, like, works in Wall Street. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like my. Like, I feel like so many 22-year-olds look older. We had this conversation She's before. 22? I don't believe that. Look yes, she is. No, we'll do it later. <laughs> but, um, yes, that's Alex Earl. She's okay. very big right now. All She's the dating camaraderie. John Summit. No, her oh. sister. Oh, God. Ashton. Ashton. listening to me. Ashton Earl. I'm even listening. Is Alex Earl's sister. Okay. Okay. Ashton is dating John Summit. How old is Ashton? I don't know. 20, 21, 20, 22? 21? No, 20. 2020. Because she's a <laughs> sophomore in... High school? <laughs> no, in college. Because everyone's like, oh, Ashton Earl's a sophomore in college and she's dating John Summit, going to Ibiza and going Wait, to all these shows. How old is John Summit? Isn't that kind of ick? I think he's 27. Oh. And he's never bought a girl flowers. <laughs> what? what? How what? do you know all this? <laughs> he said, I'm not that big of a fan. <laughs> How could you possibly 20? know that? Is that something he came out he and said? said yes. What do you do? See, <laughs> Sylvia gets what do you do? me. She what? gets me. I <laughs> can't hear underneath this cowl. He never bought a girl flowers. John Summit? Yeah. Yes. Why did he And he publicly that? announces that? Yes. Okay, it was a whole thing. If you're not like in that zone, I can't just dive into it. 27 and 21 is kind of weird. I think she's 20. That's not I think weird. she's 20. That 20, you can't even drink. I know. Well, that, see, that was the thing because one time I got asked out by a guy in a grocery store. I was 20. I would say, and yeah. he was 27, and I regret like, Back up, Leonardo I, DiCaprio. I, <laughs> I regret to this day not going out with him. I still think he was my husband. <laughs> I do. You will find your way Don't back you to have each his other. Phone number still? Yeah, but what am I going to do? Message him? Five years later, you do should it. be yeah. like, "This do is it on the so." Podcast. Do it on the podcast. Like, I know this, this is, is so random, random, but you asked me out in a straw five years ago, <laughs> and if there's any chance that you are still single, would you want to go grab drinks with me tonight? 
Uh, that is crazy. You said since you're vegan, you seem like a pretty fun Wait, was guy. Was he vegan? Yeah, because yes, that's why he came up to me. He was like looking at my We're car. Just brush past that beautiful pun. He literally came up to me, and I, he this was is like, "I dress as Shrek to try to get more attention from the attention that I lose." Um, he literally came up to me and he was like, this is so weird. He was like, but I'm like, he was made a joke. And he was like, I'm cart stalking you. And he was like, are you vegan? And he was like, I didn't like see any animal products. And then I was like, oh my God, are you also vegan? And I was like, not as having the same car. And then he was like, this is like, he was like, this is so not me. But like, I like just, I've been like trying to meet more vegan people. And he what was like, twist. That and is, is so nice. And then she was the 10th girl. Yes. Maybe I could have been, but then like I had to like politely the tenth turn vegan him down. Girl? No, 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 no. No, you didn't politely turn down. You literally got his phone number. Well, after I didn't realize how old he was because I thought he was closer to my age. My biggest thing was I couldn't Wait, how drink old was he? yet. He was 26 and she was 20. Uh, so I, he old, wanted to go to now, a bar. Okay. So wait, how old is he now? So he was six years older than you. At yes. The time. So he's. Right. So now he's 30. 30. Mm -hmm. That would be crazy if I had a 30 year old boy. Would you date John Summon? But I don't know. I met someone at John Summon. He was 29. And I was like, maybe I need to just start aging up. Maybe. (laughs) Maybe the men in my age range just aren't hitting the caliber. And maybe a, that's how Ashton feels. You need a, It might be. You need a matuated man. Ew, can we stop <laughs> saying that word? Can you please look this up in a dictionary so I can see that it actually exists? Hey Siri, define match. You didn't. Hey Siri, define <laughs> matuated. What'd she do? Like, he just loves to put the blame on me for things I don't do. This seems like protection. Yeah, <laughs> you. <laughs> you keep messing up Siri. De- De- Siri? But my phone is broken. I'm telling you, it's not oh going to work. God. The speaker doesn't De- work. If you keep yapping over Siri, she will not work. Define matuated. Waiting. Uh, Waiting. Actuate. <laughs> Uh, Sylvia said it's not coming up in Google. Oh, you're lying. You're lying. <laughs> she you're said lying. there's no word, <laughs> no searches. <laughs> oh, that makes okay. more sense. Well, you need a. I don't like originating from the word mature. mature. I do, I like that word less than I do matuated. Maturated sounds 